All right, let's do Sagittarius. Fine. It popped out twice, so there you go. Um, with the Page of Swords, I don't get that that's delayed news. That feels like um, an immaturity of some sort. So we have a an immaturity and a moving on to better times. So page of pentacles is another child. The devil. Ace of Pentacles. Temperance. King of Wands. Two of Swords, King of Swords, Three of Wands, Five of Pentacles, The Sun, Three of Cups, Eight of Cups, The Death Card, The World Card, The Nine of Swords, and then the Nine of Wands. Let's go across. First cards first is the Page of Pentacles. Pages bring news. This is usually news of money that is sitting there for you, but um, there is the Devil card. So there is some greed and some there is let's go. Let's keep going. The Ace of Pentacles is a new money venture, and then the Temperance is the resolution. Um, there is a warning on who you do business with for Sagittarius. There are people around you who have a lot of youthful exuberance, who also have a lot of youthful immaturity. They're not going to necessarily steal money, but they don't have the greatest of morals. So it's sort of a it's sort of a not to to bash Walmart, but you can do that if you want to. But that's not what this is about. So I'm not trying to go there. But like if you have a mom and pop store that's been in the community for 30 years and then you move a Walmart across the street from it. It's technically not wrong. It's just not right. <laughs> it's just it's just one of those things to where you don't really need to do that, but you do it anyway. And it does, I mean, you know, it pays off, but is that really what you want to do? Now, if it is, go ahead because, you know, hell, the strongest survive. I'm not judging it. I'm just saying that's what it is. The end. So there is some, like I said, youthful exuberance. There's some youthful energy around a business venture for you. There you go. King of Wands. There is a fire sign man. I think that is the one I was thinking about. But anyway, there's a fire sign man. And then decision. Oh, but you are a fire sign. This is Sagittarius. And king of swords 
So there's a stalemate between the two of you. It's not an argument or a fight or anything. This is more of a pro and con list now. So should we do this? Should we do that? You do come to a resolution. So the three of wands is your idea is off the ground. Uh, for some of you, there is some, some heartache on the way that is being shunned, sort of being tossed out with the bath water, thrown out in the cold. This is also a financial hardship of some sort. There's the sun. It, um, it gets better with the right people around you and leaving behind that which no longer serves you. So you clinging to something does not help you. You know where not to go and you know what not to do. There's the childish immaturity and not immaturity as in bratty, just immaturity as in maybe a little naivety. But you can move to a better time. You just have to abandon that which no longer serves you. There is a better time ahead of you. But in order to cross that bridge, you have to get rid of that which has thrown you out anyway. Because this may be more of a personal connection, the reason why you feel the need to cling to it. But you know who is not for you is not for you. Every leaf doesn't bear fruit. So anyway, start preaching now. So there is the death card. There's a major change on the way for something is coming to a completion. You don't necessarily like it because you are living in your head right now. Get out of your head, let go of the past feelings, let go of the, I don't want to kick and scream immaturity. You have to let that go. That's the only way you move forward to the new job, new money, new place, new venture, whatever. Now this could also be you, Sagittarius man. This is a fire sign, the wands are fire signs. So whatever this is that you refuse to leave behind, you need to leave it behind because it's gonna be stripped from you anyway. This is not a choice, this is a change because something is over, something is completing. Maybe it's something you've been working on that you're sad that it's over because what do I do now? You plan. Fire signs are fire signs. They're, they're people of action. So plan. Let go of the immaturity. Plan. Let go of the childlikeness. Plan. There is a child though. An earth sign child. So Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. There's an earth sign child and a king of wands. So maybe this is that child's father. Um, there's some hardship or some sort of um, being shunned. Maybe your family doesn't like him because of the child. Maybe the child is the outside child of the marriage or something like that. But everything does change. I'm not saying for the better or for the worse, but since this is where you are with being shunned, being thrown out, I can say this is for the better because there's a change to it. There's the devil card. There is some addiction. This is usually like sex, money, drugs, alcohol, or gambling, I should say, instead of money. Whatever it is that you chain to, whatever abuses you as you abuse it, it does carry a decision. You do come to a crossroads. Luckily, there are people around you who do know how to get you out of it. But confirmation means that you need to acknowledge it first. And then the world will heal for you. That is completion. That is also major change as well. Both of those are major changes. 
the Ace of Pentacles. For Sagittarius, there is a financial venture of some sort that you do want to go down the road on. There is a King of Swords who will be able to help you with that. There is a partnership. So you will have to relinquish some of the, the I should say, rights, but some of the profits, some of the ownership of that financial venture. So maybe you have an invention that you need an investor on. He can help you, but some of that has to be his. So that's up to you. It does cause a little bit of anxiety, worry, and depression, but you know, again, do you want it or do you not? Temperance. There is a healing. I feel as though like actual healing. Maybe someone's getting over something, some sort of sickness or cold or allergy or something like that, because there it is sort of off the ground. There is abandonment. So you are looking towards a new horizon moving forward. So I think um, if you were going through some sort of treatment of some sort, you are going to a better place for that. Not heaven, but you're going to towards better horizons. And that was your moving from hard times to good times. Come March 2019. And that one popped out, so I'll leave it at that. The Ten of Wands, that is a card of burden, being weighed down, unable to move. Do with that what you will. That is... Sagittarius for 2019 March.